Honduras items 2, Perfected Repetition, and 3's Company. Now, the problem we have is we could just play Twisted Fate, Hard Force here. I don't have a blue buff, and I don't have other good items. And um, we will definitely get contested by somebody, at least. Oh, he's playing Chugath, though, right? He's playing Twisted Fate, for sure. It's not, it's not worth, it's not worth. Just take this, it's beyond broken. Archangel. Can I play something with Archangel? Not really, right? I can't win streak early here. I just make 10, I just make 10. We'll just wait, we'll just reroll everything. Uh, we will just not do anything early. We will just reroll all our items, <laughs> see what we get, and um, we basically just aim for one of the S tier comps, right? I mean, I probably should have gone Jin here. I should have bought Jin for sure. I should have bought Jin. Oh, I have really perfect Chogath items now, but isn't Chogath contested? Let me just check. I'm pretty sure Chugat is hard contested. Jin is already, or I mean not Jin, Zaya is already contested. Demacia is contested. It looks like Chugat is contested. But he, pop, he popped a rapid fire cannon. So I don't even know if Chugat is contested. He popped a rapid fire cannon. Is Chugat contested? That's the question. It's not I should go this. I think I'll save the individual items. I'm not gonna make a Dragon Claw. But I'll save the Redemption for now. I need to see if I get some more Chugafs, then I can commit to it. If I don't get more Chugafs, we don't commit to it. Not really getting more Chugafs. It's looking like a rough one, guys. It's looking like a rough one. Let me just check again, man. What is that guy doing? Is this guy just playing full void? Oh, he's just playing full void. Chugaf is contested. Okay, I'm not playing Chugaf. not worth um the reason why uh Pandora's items is so broken now you don't just hard force one comp you you play flexibly according to the units you get usually you would play flexibly according to the items you get and then aim for the units now you get the units and you aim for the items but you need to decide at a reasonable pace you can't just reroll your items for the entire game otherwise you will lose too much health early game and mid game as well so by the time mid game comes you need to be con you need to be committed to something. I feel like Noxus is uncontested, no? Noxus looks really good here. The thing is, he's gonna buy a Mordekaiser, but that's it. Noxus looks good-ish. This guy is gonna pivot. This guy is... Uh, like, I already saw him a couple games ago. He just only plays with the fate, doesn't know anything else, so that's good that we know him. It's very easy to just, uh, yeah. There's my rapid fire. Okay, yeah, we just go Noxus with rapid fire Mordekaiser and we're good to go, right? That's pretty good. Rapid fire Mordekaiser and we're good to go, yeah? And we just go seven Noxus. Should be okay. Maybe we can kill one more unit. Ooh, if we can kill this Cassidy, that would be lovely. That would be lovely. Save some HP here. That's not bad. Nice. Think he will die. Let's go. Good job. Okay. Okay, so we just go Vordekaiser, I guess. It's definitely the worst one out of all the options I had, but it's the least contested one. 
And um, the thing is, I don't have any Noxus now. Like, I need to roll on 6 to get Noxus. But then I can't find Mordekaiser. It's, 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 it's not looking good. It's not looking good for me, man. It's definitely not looking good for me. Which one is the Chugat that stacked up health? This one, right? Yeah, we keep him. We keep him then. Let me just see if someone else is full loss streak. This guy. Is he gonna make himself weaker though? I think he will. I don't know if I'm weak enough. No, he didn't make himself weak enough. I think I'll definitely uh, lose this. That's good. Okay, so we play Mordekaiser, I guess. Yeah, we just go double uh, Rapid Fire Cannon. Double Rapid Fire and Giant Slayer or something like that. Double Rapid Fire Giant Slayer should be the best build, right? With seven Noxus. And we should be good. The Giant Slayer is really important for him because he, only, he has no backline access. He needs to kill all the tanks first before he can move on to the backline, so... Giant Slayer is super important. The thing is, can can Noxus win against freaking multicasters? Probably not. Static Shiv. I lose this fight for sure. Will I lose this fight? Maybe not like this. Maybe like this I don't lose it. <laughs> oh no 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 no. I have two Bruiser. I have two Bruiser. I have Shurima. Should be fine, man. I don't think I need any of these units. I could go for um, Mila as well. Ooh, I, the thing is, Bilgewater is contested. I could just go Bilgewater. I don't want any of these items yet. I, I don't want any of these items. Oh, Nasher's Tooth is insane. I think I'm just going Mordekaiser, huh? Oh, look at this Bilgewater shop. Ah. Man, look at this Bilgewater shop, man. I think I just play Bilgewater here for a turn. I just play Bilgewater for one turn. I save this Nasher's Tooth for now. I save the belt as well. Wait, who did I give it to? If I get a Bilgewater emblem here, I go. Uh, I try to. Um, I play Bilgewater. I can make it second Bilgewater emblem. Then I just play Nila. But Nila is gonna be really contested, but I can just roll down on seven. Because the problem with Noxus is, I don't have Noxus stacks yet. And then even if I roll down on 7, I might not be able to stabilize. <laughs> no, that's great, guys. Isn't this better? I just get good tank items. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going dead last. I'll keep it a buck fifty. <laughs> what am I playing, man? <laughs> what the frick am I playing? Um, Noxus or Bilgewater? Noxus or Bilgewater? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, guys. I have 50 health left. I need to decide soon. I guess I just roll down and see what I get, right? I'll just roll down and see what I get. I'll just roll down next turn, see what I get. The thing is, do I really want to play uh, Mordekaiser with these items without Giant Slayer? 
against multicaster people that will have three star, uh, three star dude, three star Galio. Also, this guy is just uncontested, multicaster now. <laughs> Well, well, well. Maybe there's a Tactician's Crown. Let's hope for a Tactician's Crown. Maybe there's another Spatula. That saves me, yeah. That, that would save me super hard. I just go, uh... I just play Mordekaiser and the Seer. Together. GG. Three Noxus or something. It's not even that bad. Tactician's Crown. GG. Or I can just play straight up Mordekaiser and the Seer together. With Noxus Emblem. No Tactician's Crown. I feel like the, the, the Nasus is the most useful. Out of all of these units, I feel like Nasus is the most useful. I have uh, perfect items for Nasus if I play Shurima. I could also go for Shurima Emblem. Shurima Mordekaiser. Okay, okay, you know what? I think it's just a Shurima Mordekaiser, bro. I think that's it. Frick it. I'm just leveling here. Oh, frick. Hello? Oh, frick. Oh, frick. Shurima Mordekaiser. It's just a Shurima emblem, bro. That's fine, yeah. I keep all the Shurimans. Sell all the other trash. Ooh, I get a... Nah, it's still a really bad loss, huh? No. I have 30 health, guys. I have to roll here. <laughs> Yes, I, I don't like TFT right now, man. I just don't like TFT. How can it be this bad, though? Like, you just have to hard contest something because the other comps are so freaking awful. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Any Mordekaisers? Hello? Frick it, I get, um, <laughs> I get a duplicator, I'm saved. I get a duplicator, I'm saved. It's over. I get a duplicator, I'm actually saved. GG. <laughs> or I just get a third, um, Bel um, Belveth, I don't give a frick, guys. Give me a third Belveth, I'm going first. GG. Edge of Night, it's a force. Okay, I definitely want to play this thingy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't want to play him. So I want to play 6 Shurima, right? I want to play 6 Shurima. So I'm playing this. I'm playing uh, this. I'm probably just not playing... Well, I'm not playing this. I'm not playing this and then adding him. Level 8, 6 Shurima, 3 Noxus. Not even that bad. This is nothing yet. I didn't get a duplicator. Deserve. Deserved, bro. It's so deserved. Wow, that was well deserved, man. Wow, that was so well deserved, bro. Like, have you ever seen something this well deserved? I, I haven't. I haven't, guys. Do I go Shurima on? Do I go Shurima on Belvet? I don't think it's that good, right? Is Shurima good on Belvet? 
Like, isn't Edge of Night really important? Is Shurima better than Edge of Night? You know what? I, I think it's fine. I, I think we just go Shurima and Belveth. Shurima and Belveth, freak this guy. Ah, uh, Shurima and Belveth. Belveth. It's fine. Should be okay. <laughs> Recombobulator. <laughs> I could get a different 2 cost. 2 cost, uh, 5, uh, 2 star, 5 cost, but we don't want that. Uh, healing Orbs is really good here. Healing Orbs gives me a little bit of bonus health. I mean, I could go triple rapid, but isn't that just overkill? Like, it's just overkill, right? Like, we definitely go for the Shrima emblem on her, right? I could go Static Shiv on him, which is good. But at the end of the day... At the end of the day, most of the damage is just true damage by her. She has a little bit of magic. I mean, honestly, Static Shiv on him is pretty okay, right? It's pretty good, like... It's pretty freaking good. Bah, I don't know. Do I really need it? I'm going fast 9 anyway, I'll hit Heimer. I'll be able to play Heimer. Nah, frick it. I want a Giant Slayer on him. I need a Giant Slayer on him, so let's save one ball. I definitely go Shurima Emblem on her, man. Yeah, it should be okay. I just play um, Nefiri instead of... Like, I, I need my Rod. I need a Rod. Nice, the Healing Orb is nice, man. And the Healing Orb is actually nice. Yeah, and, and she's gonna heal from Shurima, right? She's gonna heal quite a bit from Shurima, and it's percentage health healing. Frick it. And now I have this guy, which is insane. Uh, that's actually mental, though. That's actually mental. How crazy that is. I just roll on 8. What do I play on 8, man? Do I even play this guy? I think I don't even play the, the, the guy. Bro, there's no way I'm playing Swain, right, anymore? I'm not playing Mordekaiser, so I don't need Noxus. Just sell him. And I would rather play a 2-star Jarvan for the stun. We just need some CC. We're severely lacking CC. I got so lucky, bro. But guys, okay, so remember, Belveth is not that good right now. Like, all the legendaries are not that impressive right now. So while this is insane, obviously, this is extremely lucky and extremely insane right now, I will have to do something for the next stage. Like, I will have to go level 8 and find some other stuff. Otherwise, uh, it's not going to be good enough. Oh, why did I take this Giant Slayer? Oh, I forgot. I forgot about the Giant Slayer. I mean, there's a Heimerdinger. I'm just grabbing the Heimerdinger. Actually, very surprised that I got that. Because I was sleeping, man. I was looking at my Giant Slayer that I forgot. I think this Augment was actually really insane. Because the Nasus, uh, the Nasus is just so good with this. It's just the best items on Nasus. And he really needs these items. After all the nerfs he received, he needs exactly these items to really be that powerful tank. But he is extremely powerful if he has this. Okay, I mean, I just go level 8, I play Heimer, right? Level 8, I just play Heimer, roll it down. I don't even need this then. I don't even need this. 6 Shurima, Heimer, GG. Uh, this thing is trash. I need a Cassante. Yeah, okay, cool. Alright, GG. <laughs> so funny, man. And 6 Shurima got buffed like twice in a row, so it's actually really strong. He's level 8, I'm a little bit scared. Level 8 with 2 star Mordekaiser. I'm definitely scared here. No Edge of Night, look I'm just getting Shrek. I'm just getting Shrek, see? No Edge of Night, I just get Shrek. Unless... Why am I stunned, hello? Okay, nice. Yeah, she's healing quite a bit, percentage health. I remember when... when um. When Belveth gets her first reset, or her first kill, where she jumps onto the enemy there, does her little explosion, that's when she gets bonus health. We don't need heal reduction, we'll have Heimerdinger. And uh, that's where she gets some bonus health. So the bonus health is pretty good, right? Each Lash deals... I think it's written here, yeah. Coral is consumed, she deals 10% maximum health with magic damage. The first Coral increases her maximum health by 50%. So basically, she gets a lot of health, and then the percentage health healing of Shurima is very nice. So, 
Prima Belveth is pretty good. This guy already has a three star. I mean, he has golden ticket. I think I lose against him. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure I lose because I have a one star Nasus as well. One star Nasus. Okay, we, we did win. Okay, nice, nice. Good job, good job. I thought the Nasus would die quicker. Nasus doing really well, yeah. With these items, super good. Six Shurima also insane. Just a very, like, instead ascending at combat star. It's just so good. Oh, double Shurima, right? I, I want Shurima emblem here. Oh. Okay, I mean, I could go Guard Breaker. Yeah. Mana Zane. Not really. Hull Crusher is... I already have items on him, man. I could remove one, put Warmogs on somebody else. I feel like it's not even worth. Gunblade is good. And just reforge Warmogs. Sure, I'll take that. I don't want to roll too much. I don't want to waste too much gold on that. I don't want to waste too much gold on that. Imagine the dummy would re-roll. That would be funny, no? There we go. We get that little dummy. Perfectly fine. I'm pretty sure I level here, right? I'm not going to be greedy. Just get those uh, Heimerdinger upgrades. I mean, one burn is good. One Goldenator. Alright, sure. And then just uh, Armor Pen, Magic Pen, and we're good to go. We have everything two star. I'm insanely strong right now. I'm just waiting with these items. The thing is, who do I even give these items to? Probably just Aatrox, right? This guy's going full void reroll. So he's really strong. But I think Belveth is really good against that with her true damage. With her percentage true damage, so. We're good against tanks. Okay, so I, I couldn't get um th that was the that was the portal which gives you nice that's really big. I don't know what other items I go for here. I, like I'm definitely going for a giant slayer on him. And then I'm sure I'm just going for Cassante items, right? And the Bremble Vest isn't even that bad. It's pretty good against a lot of enemies here. Rebel Vest is pretty good against a lot of enemies here. I can just park it on this guy. Park the Bramble Vest on this guy. And then the thing is the Warmox is also really good. But then I, it's gonna take so long until I get a Giant Slayer. Yeah, yeah, a Giant Slayer is so important. Let's just wait. We wait because three items have a higher chance to reroll into a sword than one item, right? So we just wait. We just go fast nine now. I never got this lucky, by the way. This is like level seven, two star, five cost. It's been it's been many months since I got that. It's actually hilarious, guys. <laughs> it's been many, many months, many months. But it's well deserved, guys. You know me. It's extremely well deserved. Yeah, everyone got an emblem. Look, this guy just has can go nine Noxus soon. He could go 9 Noxus now, but he doesn't have room, or he doesn't have the units, I think. He's missing, like, a unit or something. Unlucky for him, but lucky for me, man. I, w I wouldn't want him. Yeah, this is a, this was one of the Warlord's Palace thingies. It gives you the treasure armory, and uh, it can be Radiant items, and then everyone gets a Radiant item, right? Everyone gets, like, a fair thingy. And sometimes it can be the choice between Orn item and an emblem. And, but to get the emblem you want, I would have to roll so many times there. So uh, as soon as I get the gun blade and some other acceptable things, I'm fine, you know? I'm fine with it. So this guy just died before he hit 9 Noxus. That's really good for me. Because he would be really strong late game. There's another uh, Shurima emblem. Uh, there's, a, there's a thingy emblem. This thingy emblem. I would take this because... Uh, someone, yeah, he hits maybe 9 juicers. Juggernaut emblem. I'm just going for this guy and reforging. The items are so bad. I'm just going for this guy and rerolling the item. Um, so yeah, I was gonna take this, but he's first pick, so he gets it. 
to deny him a Bilgewater emblem. Because him having another Bilgewater emblem is very, very scary. But I don't think he can make it to level 9. I don't think he's making it to level 9. He's hard stuck level 7. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. So that's not the biggest deal then. That's pretty good. Still makes him a lot stronger though. Okay, also these guys should probably be next to each other. Okay, let's go. Huge. I'm against the Twisted Fate player. Or no, it's not the Twisted Fate. He has the same augments. That's why I was thinking. This guy is uh, definitely weaker than me, right? He was scary a couple of stages ago, but now... After I have two-star Nasus, I don't think he's scary anymore. My Nasus is just insane now. He does manage to kill it, but... Look at my Velvet. Something bugged. Something got bugged. My, my units just disappeared. My units just... This guy was full HP, wasn't he? Something just turbo bugged. The freak was that? Hello? I'm pretty sure it bugged, right? I'm not seeing things. Redemption is not bad. Redemption is not even bad, bro. Redemption is good enough. I still don't have a Giant Slayer, which is actually, uh, yeah, the only way we can really lose this uh, this game is if we still don't have a Giant Slayer. For like 50 turns. But I, I think my bell is just too strong, man. Super lucky. I don't know how, I don't know what this game is, man. Not only is the meta trying to cause you headache, but it's also bugged. GG. Um, okay, so we want to go level 9. The, the thing is, I could have gone level 9, right? If I had the win streak. But losing the win streak actually loses me like 15 gold. Because I don't go, I don't have the win streak here, I don't have the win streak here, and I don't have the win streak here. So I, I lose so much gold now. Um, which, yeah prevents me from going level 9. So uh, I might still lose the game actually. I'm not even kidding. Don't worry. You can learn so much from failure. Duplicator does nothing. I cannot really level. I finally get my Giant Slayer. That's great. What am I looking for here? I already have Static Shift. Do I just go Ginsu's on Heimer? I mean, I could go Infinity Edge on Aatrox. Oh yeah, look, Hodge Infinity Edge. Great. Infinity Edge. I have the Trash Duplicator, which doesn't do anything. I mean, I, I, I can't really do anything. I just gotta hope I win this fight. Just gotta hope I win this fight, guys. I can't level. I need 2-star Aatrox, and then I'm pretty sure I win the game. If I get that. This guy is very strong, though. I don't know if I'm winning. I don't know if I'm winning this fight. It looks good though. It's looking good. Belveth still pretty very healthy. Yeah, nice. Alright. Good job, good job. That was scary. Okay, so we have this trash duplicator. I think I should just sell it, right? Not use it on the legendary. Oh nice. There's my dude. Hear my name and know my strength. Oh no, I'm so stupid. I don't have a 3 cost. I'm so stupid. I could have duplicated and then played Scion. Ah, I should have duplicated a 3 cost first. And then I would have had 5 gold now. I could have played Scion. So dumb. So dumb. Really, just my bad. Really, just my bad. Super stupid. Please win this fight. Oh, we might actually lose this fight, yeah. We lose this fight. Oh, he has three-star Mordekaiser. Never mind. Wait, I'm dead. I'm dead, no? Isn't it bugged? Wait, it's not bugged? Okay. Wait, it's such a weird game, man. What, what is happening? Another thingy. 
Do I move these items even to the other dude or not? Nah? To, the, to, the, to this guy? No, not yet, right? It's not better yet. It's not better yet. It is 6 Shurima, though. It is 6 Shurima, man. I feel like it's better. Okay, I'm pretty sure I'm second, right? I can't beat Mordekaiser 3, but I can win against this guy and not die. I'm against his ghost. That's pretty good. Ah, he almost kicked the uh, Cassidy out, but he couldn't. My Bellet is so tanky, I think I'm fine. Yes. And the 3 star Mordekaiser just wins, right? He's just gonna win the game. Ah, uh, another Shurima emblem. Doesn't really do that much, and he's gonna take it away in yeah, anyway, yeah. He's not stupid. Break it, I'll just take this. Double Infinity Edge, Aatrox, and I get 5 gold. Heimerdinger. Nice. Double Infinity Edge, Aatrox, frick it. Giga Chad. Giga Chad. Okay, can we win this? Can we somehow win this? What do you think? I don't think so. I should have paid attention, man. Um, we're on this side. I wanted to be on the other side, opposite, but it's fine, it's fine. Like low key. Low key. Low key, we just focus him, we get lucky. The Belvet just focuses him. He's focusing him. Everyone's focusing him. Nah, it's impossible. Unless. Nah, he almost got kicked out. That was kind of close. <laughs> okay, we'll take it. Second place is great here. Second place is great. I was going dead last, and then I just find three bell lifts. Did I deserve to win? No, man. I just got blatantly lucky. Like a blatantly disgustingly lucky. We'll take a second place, bro. Level 7, three bell lifts. GG, guys. Deserved. Subscribe and notification bell if you enjoyed these TFT videos. Also, make sure to leave an algorithmic comment and an algorithmic like down below to support this video in it algorithm so I can get some more views, and I'll see you next time. Peace.